I'm making part of a clutch for a vintage car and I'm uh, roughing it out on the pacemaker before I put it in the CNC late because I want to get it uh, round and uh, down to uh, diameter closer to the finish size because I'm going to bore soft draws in the late and uh, then turn it so I'll just rough it down here and turn it around and rough down that and then we'll face uh, the sides We got the second side roughed in here, so we did a couple of hundreds of millimeter. So we'll take this side down and we'll just face this off so we don't have any rust there. And we'll take this down to 195 millimeters or something like that. Let's see about the cutting data here. Iranian uh, Iskar CNMG insert um, 0.8 nose radius uh, running about 140 meters per minute or 460 surface feet um, the feed is uh, almost 16,000 per rem it's 0.4 millimeter and the depth of cut is 150 tau or 1.9 millimeter so we're taking off 3.8 of the diameter in each cut.
I've been wanting to make a set of machinist jacks for quite some time. Now I made a prototype here. Um, the base is 40 millimeters high, and uh, top is 7 millimeters high, or uh, top here. So the total height will be 47 at the minimum setting. And uh, depending on, on how little tread engagement you dare to have, you can can go up to almost 80. <coughs> and I just ground off the pip from parting here. If I make more of them, I will machine that side too. <coughs> and it has uh, 24 millimeter hex down here, 19 millimeter hex there. M12 thread, and um, it's made from 4140 heat treated, so it's about 28 to 30 Rockwell C. And uh, this is just a prototype, so uh, if you feel like it, you can come with uh, ideas on how to improve it, what you think should be, if anything, should be changed. If I get some good ideas, I might make another prototype, but um, we'll see. <clears throat> anyway, if uh, anyone wants a set of these, I'll make more than the set for me, and uh, I'll sell them to you for a reasonable price. I don't know uh, what the reasonable price will be, but I'll figure it out, and I'll make a text in the video so you can see how much it will cost for a set. There's one more thing. Uh, when, uh, if you want to have, have it high at the higher settings, um, I want to lock it, then you can just put an M12 nut on there and lock it down like so. I wanted to have a low profile M12 nut, but uh, I don't know. We will see if uh, a lot of people want this. Uh, then I'll uh, try to find uh, some low profile M12 nuts and buy those. So you can get them with a set instead of everyone buying their own low profile nuts.